Ann Newman. I'm the Exhibitions Design Lead here at Liberty Science Center and the Project Director, Creative Leader for Beyond Rubik's Cube Project. Our CEO, who is a mathematician, has direct interest in the topic and his world had crossed over with Erno Rubik, so when he came here we seemed to be the perfect venue to be able to create interactive science experiences, understand the math, uh, and bring something to audiences that would actually be interesting because not everybody, as ubiquitous as this is, gets this, likes this, uh, wants to be engaged with it. So our challenge is to take the cube and make it interesting to also ordinary people that extend beyond the natural geek constituency that lives and loves this. People will not be expecting what they see because I think you expect to come in and see the cube and maybe lots of different cubes, blown up cubes, smaller cubes, and we have, for the most part, tried to sort of twist that on its end. It's beyond the Rubik's Cube to upend your expectations. So I think immediately the entry experience alone, which is just spectacularly fun and beautiful, uh, it's all about being able to take a starting point and work with it to create something new, to transform it into a different shape, into a different... So it's, it's about basic problem solving. This being a spur to what we need today, people who are creative visionaries, who solve problems, do it with persistence, build a community that uh, supports them in their uh, explorations, because um, that's really where the fun in life is. You find your passion and, and work with it. I think I'm actually looking forward to seeing people walk through the exhibition because uh, we create something that we, we can test partially and we hope um, people will enjoy it, but we're also projecting some of our own interests and passions and visions onto something that other people will enjoy. So seeing real visitors come through with their reactions, how they actually work with what we're providing, um, is always just tremendously interesting. And, and that's the real success. What do people carry away as hopefully a powerful emotional experience that uh, gets them thinking, gets them playing, gets them building.